Hey, how's it going outlaws and welcome back to another Red Dead Redemption 2 video and today we are on a journey to go and rescue Mr. Morrison. Um, he's been in jail since the Saint-Denis robbery, which was um, quite a while ago to be honest. So he's been there for a while. So here we are with, um, we're gonna go meet Sadie and we're gonna get my boy out of jail. We're gonna break the bars and get him out. Um, where is it? There we are. Hi guys. Oh, oh God. I must come. He's my husband. I know he's just. Sorry about that. I insist. <laughs> she insists. She insists. All you lack ain't happening. Arthur Taylor. Taylor what? She ain't coming with us to collect her husband. I Abigail, you ain't coming. That's the end of the matter. See there, you heard him. Now let's go. But, but nothing. It'll be quicker and easier with just the two of us. Plus, John will be calmer without worrying about you. Ain't complicated. Well, well I ain't the crime sort, but I'm real grateful. Yeah, we know you are. We'll bring him back to you. Thank you. Thank you both. Oh, the music right. in the background is the uh, is my PlayStation the theme music. Hopefully give us a bit of cover to move in close right. enough to find a spot and look for John. Right go. This time of day, get me boy. Probably be working the fields. Then all we gotta do is take out all the guards and row our way out of there. Seems simple enough. Very simple. How many times, Marston? Aw, big brother gonna go save his little bro. It's a nice windmill. See, I've always wanted to go there, but it's like okay, you can never stop. travel there. I don't think you can anyway, because I tried it, but then my boat just sinks and then my stamina just drains so fast and then I die. We're good. Sneaky sneak. Right, follow me, Sadie. Come on, Sadie. I'm gonna knife him. And stab his back. Where's Sadie? Come on, Sadie. Oh, the music is literally the PlayStation theme that I have. Like, right now on my PlayStation. Right, let's go. Just nice and easy. Stealth kill! Yeet. Thank you. Oh, I don't want to drop my Lancaster repeater for that. Can I drop my bolt? Okay, yes. I'll drop my bolt for this one. Look for John. All right. Where's John? He ain't here, boy. Hey, I think I see him. There's a group in front of that barn, just to our right. Oh yeah, I see two guards. This one looks like John. Okay. This one right Take here. Them out and let's go get our boy. All right, I'm gonna headshot okay. this guy. You ready? Oh, nice. oh, I fucking killed him, Sadie. Did you see that? I'll headshot this guy even though he won't die. Wait, shit! I don't think that was John. Well, let's go over there and see. Okay, come on. I think one of those guards was still moving. I headshotted both of them, but okay. Let's go investigate the fi Sadie. Can you hurry up? Thank you. Thank you. We've just saved all these random people. Right, let's go. Oh, my shoes are wet. It's a nice little barn. Come on, Arthur. Let's keep moving. Where is he? You see him? No. You, <laughs> Mister. You know John Marsden? I, he ain't. He ain't working today. Put the gun down, lady. No. You put the gun down. Now. Where's John Marston? She ain't in the work detail today. Okay, well, I guess we'll go and get him together. Since when did Arthur have a, like, a mud patch on his face? Yes. Oh, my God. Oh, no. What are you gonna do, Sadie? What are you gonna do? Wreck him. 
Destroy on, him. Partner. Yes. Now, why don't you apologize to the lady for pointing a gun at her? Excuse me? Say sorry. I said apologize. I'm sorry, ma'am. Whoa, so, guys, are you not interested in the prisoners running that way? Towards the entrance, I guess. And who's in charge of this fine establishment? Jameson, sir. Jameson who? No, Mr. Jameson. Heston Jameson. Uh, very nice, fella. Uh, he's been quite in Oh, in the head, Sadie. I look forward to meeting him. They're, they're not going to let you do this. Well, that's going to be up to you, my friend. I love this mission. So, you a popular employee, my friend? Not especially. Well, I guess we're about to find out. Outlaws for life! Move away from the barrels, Arthur. It's a bit hard to control. Sadie, can you move out of the way? I'm trying to I'm trying to move away from the corner. But he's just steering into it. Hi guys! Look at them up there. Don't shoot! Don't shoot. This is what he sounded like. Wreck him, Sadie. Okay, friend, be cool now. Just do as I say. Put the weapons down now. We're here. Knock knock. Is John playing out? Is Jameson in? He's inside, Denise. They got Milliken. Got him and gonna kill him. Unless you bring me John Marston. Right now. You got one minute. I'm counting. One, two, three. Um, uh, Milliken, uh, is it? Yes, sir. Will you count for me? I got talking to do. Uh, yes, sir. Of course, sir. <clears throat> From one or four? Oh, sir? very funny. No, we must be at 11 by now. 11, 12, 13, faster. 14, 15, 16, 17. Now hurry up! Or well, this poor fool's gonna get his brain shot out. And over what? For nothing. Uh, Milliken, don't stop counting. I can't hear you. Now hurry up and bring that asshole out here, you bastards. Come on! Don't cry, buddy. I don't want to die. Yeah, I know, I know. Hey, hey, John. Hello, you too. Now, no funny business. Well, Mr. Medican here will stop crying once and for all. Okay, today's your lucky day. Let's go! <laughs> Oh no wait, I don't want to kill him because if you kill him you actually get dishonored. Can you just stop running? Stop running. Oh my god. Can I shoot? I clearly can't shoot. Is anyone else? No? Just them two? On that side anyways. Did I shoot the railing? I better not. Okay, good. I didn't. Cover us. Go. Let's move. Go. Let's go. Of course, I'll cover you guys. Don't worry about me. Oh God, Matrix. Are you sure you got me covered? I, I don't. Okay, I'm just. I'm, I'm going, Sadie. I thought you got me covered. Sadie, I thought. Oh god, I thought you got me covered, Sadie. I nearly died, bitch. Been a while, John. You're telling me. What took you so long? I'll explain later. Was that you? Yeah. Believe me, that was my one and only time flying. <laughs> oh, got him. John, we've got a lot to catch up on. Let's go. I'll protect you guys. Don't worry about me. Okay, wait, wait. I got an idea for this. Oh god, this isn't this isn't going as as I planned. Not gonna lie. I better kill all of them. Okay, 
Go, 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 go. I kill all of them. Go, 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 go. I'm running in the plants. I'm getting flashbacks of with Sean in the tobacco field. Oh, God. I don't need cover. I am the cover. No, actually, I, I need cover. There's a lot of them. Wait, do I have some dynamite? Dynamite. Dynamite. Did I just get dishonored? Why did I get dishonored? Is it because I killed a horse? I can't see what that kill cam was. Yeah, I'm trying Sadie, but I just got dishonored. Oh god, there's a lot of them, Sadie, and you expect me to... I'm only one guy, do you know what I mean? I got them, Sadie! I did it! Oh god, what the frick? There's so many! Yeah, one sec, Sadie, I'm coming. Let's go, let's go. Just move. Just go. They're never ending. I know they're behind me, Sadie. I'm running away from them. Right, I got him. Let's go. Where's Sandini? Okay, why am I even bothered about Sandini right now? Are we here? You always seem to need rescue, Arthur. Uh, nice to see you, Arthur. Uh, there's some fellas coming here. Don't look too friendly. We best get out of here. Come on, boys. Let's move. I'll row. You shoot. Seriously? Let me. You... You're a better shot. Right, fine. You just relax and enjoy yourself, John. Leave the real work to them. It's can still handle it. Thanks. Keep them off us. Right. Oh my God! Hello. I would throw dynamite, but I'm scared. I'm gonna get dishonored again. There you go. Bye bye. I think I liked you better when you was all trussed up like a prize chicken. No doubt. But oh, hurry up. They're going to be on our tails soon enough if you boys keep wasting time. Oh, that's us told them. Ugh. Hey, Arthur. Thank you. Don't mention it. Let's go. We should Let's get out of here quick before the law gets wind of this. So what the hell happened in San Denis? Is Abigail all right? Oh, he doesn't She's know fine. anything. Jack is too. She managed to escape when they got Hosea. Hosea? That still don't seem real somehow. All them years. Arthur. He was like... A father? Like family. He was yeah, like your dad. Uh, we lost young Lenny too. No. What a goddamn mess. And then we... What about the, the money? Gone. Oh, somewhere at the bottom of the ocean. What? How the hell did that happen? We hit on a boat. It's the only way out of there. The boat went down in a storm and we ended up stranded on an island somewhere near Cuba. John, if you were on that boat, you would have been absolutely Wait, goners. So let's just say that <laughs> your arrest was a, a kind of a lifesaver. But things ain't been good, John. <laughs> You're telling me. We're holed up now in the mountains to the north, near Roanoke Ridge, and some caves there. The Pinkertons caught up with us again, and we had to move. Yeah. Seems Molly ratted us out, the bitch. So she's dead too. Jesus. Maybe you should have just left me to hang. And uh, I should warn you, Dutch didn't want us breaking you out. Said it wasn't the right time, so... You might not be the hero's welcome you're imagining. So much for no man left behind. Literally. I can't stop thinking about this. In the bank, when they grabbed me, he saw it. Felt almost like he had a, a moment to do something and didn't. The Dutch ain't himself right now. Or maybe he just ain't who we thought he was. Guess we don't need to worry about who's his favorite no more. 
Yes, huh. not. Cause it's Micah. Micah is his favorite. Woohoo! We got our boy John back, though. Good for us. Home sweet home. He brought him back to me. We told you we would. John! What are you doing here? Good to see you too, partner. I meant I hadn't sent for you yet. I went. But I said that. Yeah, I know what you said. I felt different. Is that so? Yes. And when Spring and John brings the law down on all of us, what then, Arthur? Well, I guess we'll have another fight on our hands. Loyalty, Arthur, it ain't. I had a goddamn plan! John. John. You are my brother. You are my son. I was coming for you. They... They was talking of hanging me, Dutch. They was talking. They was talking. And now they may come and hang us all. Thinking of, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Dutch said to tell you he and Micah have gone to Annisburg. Something about Mr. Cornwall. Cornwall. Oh. Okay. Thanks, Mary Beth. That was a bit intense, wasn't it? Woo! Intensitivity! Right. Looks like we are going to go see Micah. All the way down in Ansbrook. Oh my god, look at that. That is atrocious. Oh my god, we're wanted on like... Oh god, we're wanted everywhere. I can't go up. Okay, so... Let's let's just, let's just go see Micah. Because, you know, he's my favourite character. Who's saying Arthur now? Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you so much. You're welcome, Abigail. Oh, he ain't done yet, Abigail. Oh, what's happening? Dutch. To have lost his mind? I know. Just be careful. I don't have to be careful. I, I have you as a friend. Did you just friends on me? <laughs> I'm joking. Because I know that, like, Arthur used to have a crush on Abigail. So, yeah, okay. I'll meet you guys when I see Micah. Wow, my favorite. Okay, so here we are in Ansberg as well. Ugh, look at how horrible and gloomy it is. Essentially, I think it's like the worst place on the map. Like, it's just... But it fits so well with where we are in the chapter because it's so dark and gloomy and where we are in the story is dark and gloomy as well, so... I don't know. Right, Micah? Where you at? Was you followed? I said no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what is your problem? What is your problem, partner? You don't uh, you don't look so good. What is wrong with you? Nothing wrong with me. I'm fit as a fiddle. And yeah, not inside you ain't. I'm just a realist, friend. Michael reckons there's a rat. Oh, does he? On what evidence? He's only back a minute. Pinkerton show up. <laughs> We've been on the run since you two fools went crazy in Blackwater. 
We barely escaped with our lives in San Denis. Now we got a rat. Well, Molly clearly talked, but who else? Maybe we pushed things too hard. Uh, Maybe time for folks like us has passed. <laughs> we don't need a rat. We got sloppier than the town drunk, and they know who we are, and where we are, and what we're doing. The way I see it, best thing we can do is let the wheat go. Move on, get our money, and start over. That ain't happening. Well, something's gotta happen, and fast. Otherwise, Cornwall, them Pinkertons, they've got us panned in here, and ain't none of them stopping. Well, Cornwall's why we're here. Shall we, Dutch? Yeah, it's time to go. Let's head to the river. Oh, leave Cornwall alone. He ain't. <laughs> we need money. But revenge? Now? Of course it's for money. Come on, Arthur. This better not be no stupid revenge mission, Dutch. It ain't worth it. Don't be ridiculous. Oh, Arthur, it's just a simple social call. <laughs> 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 Just a simple sentence. <laughs> All right, Dutch, what are you so saying? What are we going to say to him that needs to be said? Literally, he what is it? He's been hunting us since Valentine. He is the reason that Hosea got killed. His sugar business is destroying the people of Guarma. This town, Arthur, it's his town. He bought it just to destroy these folks. His sugar, his oil, his law. These are wrongs that you can't right, Dutch. We wanted men. We need to lay a law, if anything. John against my wishes. I didn't want him hanged. Neither did I. We're gonna cut a deal, Arthur. What are you talking about? <laughs> oh my we God. want out, and Cornwall wants us to stop robbing him, and we all know his money. Arthur it feels so confused because it's always He's Dutch and Micah like America. sorting out the plans Arthur. and stuff, and Arthur's not and been involved out. with the he... plans. So only come. now, when he's actually there, he's God getting a brief of what's about to will, go down. Son. It will. A deal, some noise, and then we're gone. Because how much do you want to bet? If Arthur and Dutch spoke about this before actually arriving in Ansberg, things would have gone down like differently. Arthur would have like not gone with him or something like that. I don't know. But yeah, Dutch is losing his mind. Get out of my way, Micah. Why are you so close to Dutch? Stupid. Alright, let's just wait. That was fast. <laughs> I want to thank you for your hospitality, Mr. Cornwall. This was a business meeting, Mr. Milton. We are not friends. I have spent a considerable fortune with your agency and still nothing. This Vanderlyn robs me and laughs at me. I asked for the best. I paid for the best. We are very close, Mr. Cornwall. I know you've heard this before. Can't, sir. Send a telegram to Goldberg in New York. Tell him I won't borrow it more than 3.2%. Sorry, no, I have heard it before. And get that army man to pay his portage charge. Yes, sir. We are doing all we can within the confines of the law. The law? I think we both know what you can do with your law. Find me Dutch Vanderlyn. Bring him here and leave the laws to them as need them. Good day, sir. Come along, Mr. Ross. We have work to do. Mr. Didsbury. Mr. Cornwall. Now listen up, Didsbury. What's all this about strikes? I bought into this mine because of mismanagement. And I intend to make it a success no matter what the cost. It's the wages. Folk feel Folk that you... feel? Business doesn't give two figs about feelings, sir. Not two figs. And it's a nonsense that will bring a plague on both our houses, sir. Perhaps there is a plague on your house already, Mr. Cornwall. What do you want, sir? I'm not quite sure just yet. Your impudence will be your undoing, sir. I'm undone already. Even my best friend here, he thinks I'm crazy. And like this poor fellow you are talking to, my feelings are hurt. You robbed me, sir. And you robbed him. Funny world. You show a criminal's grasp of sophistry, sir. I did no such thing. You kill. I kill. 
You rob. I rob. Only difference I can see is I choose whom I kill and rob, and you destroy everything in your path. I've heard just about enough. I'll tell you what. You give me this ship, $10,000, and safe passage out of here, I'll let you live. <laughs> I'll do no such thing! <laughs> you sure? Good. I prefer it this way. You lost your land! Noise, Arthur! Noise! You have where the hell's my okay there is. Oh I need to clean it! Can I clean my weapon right now? No? Okay. Well, I need to clean my weapon after this mission. Hiya! Well, obviously the Pinkins are here, but you literally just saw Agent Milton walk out. Like, what have you done, Dutch? Oh, I missed. Yeah, I saw him. Like, I'm constantly shooting up Ansberg, and like, I don't mean to, but it just happens, you know what I mean? Are you shooting me? Oh, are you dead? Okay, cool. Oh. Oh god, I just want to shoot his head, but never mind. It's alright, Dutch, I got him. Yeah, I see him. Oh, how did that. Alright, there we go. Get him. Oh, I need to have a cigarette. Or something. One second. Oh, is that Micah? Is he in trouble? Oh, what a shame. Right. We're going up. I'm already moving. Wait, why is there two of them? Wait, I kind of need to just... Oh, I love that. There we go. BRB, guys. Oh, I have to stop coughing. Now's all the time. Wait, where? Oh, darn it. The staircase is behind me. Hi, Dutch. I was waiting for you. Oh my god, shut up, Micah. Oh, are you joking? I'm shooting the wood instead. I didn't shoot this guy because he shot the wood instead. I can't. Right, where? Let's go. Yeah, he did. I'm going as fast as I can. Where is he? Where is he? I want to shoot him. Hard. Yeah, but you didn't have to kill him to just get papers, like... Why did I shoot the wagon? Oh. Aha, <laughs> is that why I shot the wagon? Are you still alive? Not anymore. Right, where's my horse? Right. Hello. Goodbye. Right, where's... Can I just... Can I run? I like the music. Oh god, he's already dead. Was he waving at me? <laughs> Okay, yes, let's go. Let's go. Well, at least we tried talking it out. Was lost your mind. Oh, I felt a lot of guilt in this life, Arthur. I've killed too often and poorly, but not this time, son. Come on. <laughs> All right, let's head for the hills, boys. They're trying to block us off. Go right. Oh god, I'm gonna crash into a tree or something. Ah, where am I going? 
I can't. Like, I... I have to keep my eyes on the road. <gasps> oh my god. Get out of my way, get out of my way. <laughs> right, I'm here. They're in front of us, though. Where? Oh, they're dead. Right, he's dead. You see that Dutch? I killed him. But you guys have seriously, like, lost your mind. You need to just go to therapy. Maybe a bit of counselling. You just sit down, read a book. Read one of your books again, Dutch. And Micah, I don't know what you can do. There's honestly no saving you, Micah. There's just none. Oh, God. Yeah, I can see them. Oh, really, Micah? Am I going to shoot them? I thought I was going to, you know, go to book club with them or something. I don't know why I'm obsessed with books recently. I, just, I don't know. Woo! I'm going for a swim. Done it. That wasn't too bad. We all okay? Interesting social call. No, oh, don't play dumb and superior at the same time, Morgan. We all knew sooner or later Cornwall had to go. Let me see them papers. It's more attention we don't need. Feels like the whole world's closing in on us. Dutch. It won't be long before they find where we're hiding out now. Especially as we ain't exactly hiding out. We just need a distraction. Buy us some time. It looks like Mr. Cornwall's company has signed a railroad contract with the army. And they're also moving dynamite down from, well, the Annisburg mines to San Denis to resell. And there's bonds at his oil factory. Maybe there's a way to get them off our back and get the money that we need. Mike, you look into this dynamite. Take Bill, I guess. Arthur, you go too. We are gonna need a lot of it. And Mike, we need to talk. Figure out some things. Of course, boss. Figure out what? The plan. Getting out of here. Nothing's changed. It hasn't, huh? There's an old house west of Van Horn. Meet me there when you can, Black Lung. Let's split up. We'll meet up back at camp. Yeah. This is crazy. It is crazy. It's very, very crazy. And I hate how Micah is getting inside Dutch's ear and Dutch is like getting brainwashed and it's just ugh, I hate it <laughs> like honestly Arthur you have a lot of bullet holes in your hat you're right but, oh god okay well I guess I'm gonna leave this episode here we managed to uh to rescue John and we managed to kill Cornwall which is um interesting i don't think he he needed to die it was like dutch is just going crazy so it's kind of like a he had to die kind of thing kind of like bronte's revenge mission because like bronte messed them up with the the trolley station and then cornwall messed him up with like everything since valentine so had to be done but yeah if you guys have enjoyed this video leave a like and subscribe if you're new around here for more red dead content and i will see you outlaws in the next video Bye, guys.